Madam Speaker, in 2007, the Minister of Education at, at the time, now the Minister of Jobs and Tourism, said there was as many as a million British Columbians uh, who struggled with basic literacy, literacy with things as simple as being able to read a restaurant menu. <coughs> One million people in the province, Madam Speaker. In that same year, the government eagerly embraced a recommendation from former Attorney General Jeff Plant to offer adult basic education at no, at no cost, thereby allowing thousands of British Columbians to complete their uh, high school education or qualify or upgrade to qualify for post secondary courses. So, my question is why today has this government abandoned its promise? and its commitment to adult education and decided once again to impose fees <coughs> on hard-working adults who just want to complete their high school education. Minister of Advanced Education. Thank you, Madam Speaker. The recent uh, changes in adult basic education provide that it is free in the K-12 school system. It is free to non-graduates, and it is provided at 18 post-secondary institutions around the province, uh, often free of charge because those institutions make their own decisions about whether to charge uh, tuition. The tuition is set at a maximum of $320 per course, and there is a $6.9 million fund available this fiscal year to assist with the transition to the new regime, and grants are available for low-income students. <laughs> We're going to be Deer Lake on a supplemental. Uh, thank you, Madam Speaker. The Minister knows that it's not free in post-secondary institutions and it's not free for students in, that want to upgrade and uh, go on and, and get into another course. And these are British Columbians, Madam Speaker, who are willing to do the work to better their, their lives and those of their families. Yet this government is creating new barriers. The minister knows this simply means that thousands of students that would have gone on and completed their high school or would have gone on to post-secondary education are simply not going to be able to do it. So my question again to the minister, why is the minister, why is this government breaking its promise to adults in this, in this province who simply want to finish their high school education? Minister of Advanced Education. Madam Speaker, this government is very concerned about individuals who want to improve their qualifications, to increase their talents, to work on their abilities, to be the best they can be. And with that in mind, we have increased the grant budget by 33% this year to $7.6 million. The net effect is that an individual with an income less than $23,647 will pay no tuition to do adult basic education. A family of three with an income of less than $36,192 will pay no tuition for adult basic education. And anyone within 10% above those thresholds will only pay half of the cost. 